Hello. Hello. Good afternoon, teacher. Hello. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Teacher, hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, chicas. Hi, oh, girls. Thank you, Dominica. Hi, hi. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much. All right. Um, are you drinking water? It's extremely hot right now. Please drink a lot of water. Hydrate your bodies because it's extremely hot. Right? So... Let's see, <clears throat> Friday, so it's good tomorrow for us, um, Saturday, maybe, maybe you have some plans for this weekend, maybe not, because it's too <sighs> hot, uh, it's not payday, so maybe we are going to stay at home, right? All right. So let's see, I have um, 19, 18 people here. Very good. That's cool. That's cool. Thank you, guys. So let's see. Welcome, uh, Pamela, Lisi, Karen, Lillian, um, Carla, Brenda, Dominga, Maria Fernanda. Welcome, Katia, Virgie, Andrea, Astrid. Melvin, Marvin, Berenice, Selena, and Wilbur. Hello, Wilbur. Thank Good you. afternoon. Good, no, afternoon. Teacher. Good afternoon, Wilbur. Thank you so very much for being here. Uh, ayer mandé el reporte de notas. Los que me mandaron ayer, que tengo ahí un par de WhatsApps que todavía no he visto, los voy a actualizar luego después de la clase. All right? Así que, okay. thank, you, thank you for thank you for the exams and for the screenshots and everything, so uh so we can have everything in order. All right, okay. So let's go. Let's see. <clears throat> let's begin with this class for for today, and we are going to start with the listening activity. All right. So we are going to test our listening okay so number one okay. um the audio is about a meeting you know a meeting uh that two people are having at work so they are talking about something related to a meeting but before this I have this activity that is related to the audio. Um, give me a second. All right. So look at this. I have here uh, six, six definitions, okay? So I have six definitions. Um, uh, give me a moment. Se lo voy a enseñar de otra forma mejor. All right. Very good. I think it's much better. Okay. Oh, see, much better. Mucho mejor. All right. So, you have six definitions and six phrases. All right. So, we need to match, match. All right. Match the definitions with the phrases, the phrases and the definitions. We have six definitions and we have, I mean, six phrases, I'm sorry, and we have six definitions, okay? So let's see. I'm gonna give you right now maybe two minutes, please, individually, all right, individually, Read the phrases and read the definitions. And then we are going to check the correct answer. All right? 
So let's begin right now. I'm gonna give you two minutes. Please read the phrases and try to match the correct definitions with the phrases. Let's go. Teacher, lo va a mandar en el grupo. La imagen. Just here. Just here. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Aquí lo voy a dejar. Like this. This is individual, individual uh, activity. Read carefully. Algunas preguntas, respuestas se parecen. So please read carefully. Read the phrases and read the definitions. I need to put the correct letter and the correct number. So let's go. For, for the people that it's entering right now, los que se van uniendo ahorita, there are six phrases and there are six definitions, all right? So you need to read the phrases and you have to match, match the phrases with the definitions. Let's go. Finish, teacher. Finish, excellent. <laughs> All right, so let's go. Let's see. Number one, to cancel a meeting. Who is the first volunteer who can give me the correct definition for to cancel a meeting? What is the letter? Me. F. Mm, BF. Any other? Who gives more? Letter F. Letter F? Yes. Okay. Let's see. Let's, let's put right here letter F. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Letter F. Uh, Lizzie, can you please read? the definition for letter F. Okay. To decide that a meeting will not take place. All right. To decide that a meeting will not take place. Okay. 
Everybody agrees with this definition? Everyone agrees? I put F2 in the number one. You think letter F is okay? Okay. I Perfect. think. All right. That is correct. Let's see. We're going to check them later right now. So we move on. Let's go. To confirm a meeting. To confirm a meeting. Carla, what is the letter, Carla? I see your hand. Letter is the E. Letter E. e. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, let me, let me, well, I'm sorry. Okay, letter E. All right, let's see. Mm, it's not moving. All right. Carla, can you please read the definition for letter E? To say that you will go to the meeting. The okay, meeting. to say that you will that go to a will meeting. Go to the meeting. All right, everybody agrees or maybe there is a better option. D. I put letter C. Letter, letter C as in cat? Letter D. D. Oh, letter D as in David? Yes. Okay. Yes. Can you please read letter D? Yes. Who said letter D? I, me. Me, me, all me. right, go ahead. Can you please read letter D? To say that a, may, a meeting, meeting will happen. All right, so I have a question. Which is better, letter, letter E or letter D? Mm -hmm. What do you think, letter mm -hmm. E or letter D? I think D. Letter D? Yes. Letter D. Yes. Letter D. To say that a meeting will take place. Very good. Now, let's see another. I'm going to choose a person. I'm going to choose another person. Imelda, what is number three? Please read the phrase number three. What is the phrase number three? To bring a meeting... For work. Okay. To bring a meeting forward. Okay. Now I have another question. Do you know the meaning of the verb bring forward? It's un verbo. What is bring? Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So what is the correct definition for this one? Letter A, C, C, B. Oh, I have A, C. C. <laughs> <laughs> so, to letter, 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 letter C. Letter C. All right. The correct one is letter C. Si es adelantar, entonces la respuesta es. Can, can anybody please read? A volunteer, great letters. To have a meeting at an early time or date. Excellent. So, aquí estaba la clara, right? Oh, I'm sorry. To add a later, I mean, an earlier time. Una hora más temprano. Earlier time. Earlier time. All right? Earlier time. Okay, let's see. Uh... I'm sorry. Letter one was letter F. I'm sorry, que la borré. Sorry about that. So number two, it was letter letter D. D. All right. And this one is letter C. Okay. D. Excellent. Let's continue with number three. Please, Diana Diaz. Continue with number three. Number four. Number four. Um. To postpone a meeting. Okay. To postpone a meeting. So everyone, meeting. what is the correct definition for to postpone a meeting? Letter B. Letter A. Letter A. Letter A. Letter A. 
The correct letter is letter B. B. Yes, letter B. Look at this. Look at this. Add a, um, to change the meeting at a later time. Postpone later. Postpone for later. All right. So that is the correct definition for that one. So let's continue. Um, let's see. That could be uh, letter A two. Yes, it could be. But according to the verb postpone, the most accurate is letter B. That is oh, the okay. correct. Yeah. Si no hubiese otra opción, letter A could be another one too. All right. So let's see. Number five, Wilbur, please read number five. The, to move a meeting. Okay, to move, to move a meeting. What's the letter? A. a. That is letter A. Excellent, that is letter A. And the last mm. one, oh, what's the letter A? Let's see, let's see. Um... Kenny Lemus, please read the definition for letter A. A. Yes. To change the time or date of a meeting. Excellent. Very good, Kenny. And let's finish with number five, which is, uh, let's see, Mayra, please read number five. Okay, to accept a, an invi invita invitation to a meeting. Excellent. And what is the correct answer for this one? Letter E. <laughs> Letter E. Very good. So let's see. Dominga, can you please read Letter E? This one? Uh, to, to say that to... You will go to a meeting. Excellent. Very good. That is accepting a meeting. Accepting an invitation to a meeting. Very good. Excellent, guys. So now we can continue. Look at this. Before we listen, we are going to read the, 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 the questions. Okay. Estas preguntas son las que vamos a buscar en el audio que vamos a oír. All right, so let's read the questions. Let's see. Number one, please help me. Um, Fergie, Fergie, number one, please read the, 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 um, the question, let's say, and the answers. The meeting time. Letter A. The meeting was first planned for 9 a.m. Letter B. The meeting was first planned for 11 a.m. Letter C. The meeting was first planned for 1 p.m. For 1 p.m. Okay. So, and in other words, what is the original? time for the meeting was the meeting planned for 9 for 11 or for 1 p.m what was the original time of the meeting 9 11 or 1 all right let's continue with number two caring please help us read number two and the options Number two, moving the meeting later, later eight. Mm -hmm. Lucy wants to cancel the meeting. Letter B, Luz, Lucy, está bien dicho así? Lucy. Lucy, Lucy. 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 Mm -hmm. Lucy wants to bring the meeting forward. Bring, bring the meeting forward? Meeting uh -huh. forward. Moving forward. Right. Let it <laughs> Lucy wants to postpone the meeting. Excellent. Thank you, Karen. So we have three options. 
What's going on with the meeting? Lucy wants to, Lucy wants to cancel. Lucy wants to bring it forward. Or Lucy wants to postpone the meeting. So you have three options. Cancel, move forward, que es adelantarla. So she wants to cancel, bring it forward, or she wants to postpone the meeting. All right? So you are going to look for that information. Let's continue with number three. And this is going to be for, let's see another person with the camera on, Maida. Let's go, Maida, help us with number three and the options. Okay, number three, uh, the, the new meeting time. Uh, the new meeting time is uh, 9 uh, a.m. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, B, the new meeting time is 11 uh, a.m. All right. Um, uh, C, the new meeting time is 1 p.m. Okay. Perfect. So what's the new meeting time? 9, 11, or 1 p.m.? So you are going to listen to that. Let's continue with um, another person with another camera on. And that is going to be uh, Wendy. Number four, Wendy. Okay. Number four, the, uh, the agend agenda. Agenda. Agenda, okay. Excellent. The agenda. Letter A, Anna has already sent the agenda. Letter B, Anna is setting the agenda now. Letter C, Anna will send the agenda letter. All right. So the agenda, three options. Number one, she sent it, ya la envió. Oh, she is sending it now. Or in the future, she will send it. Three options. She sent it. She is sending it or she will send it. All right. Let's continue with another. And this is going to be for, let's see another camera on. Katia Najarro, number six, Katia. Number Lucy's five, sorry. Lucy's presentation. All right. Lucy is nervous about her presentation. All right. Lucy is looking forward to her presentation. Mm -hmm. And Lucy isn't ready to give her presentation. All right. Three options. Number one, Lucy is nervous. Number two, Lucy is looking forward to it. ¿Qué es looking forward to it? Esperar con ansias. Esperar con ansias. Tener la presentación. So, is she looking forward to it? And number three, Lucy is not ready. All right? So you need to look for that information. And the last one, that is going to be for Berenice. Let's go, Berenice. Please help us read number six. Setting the other people. Tell the other others about the time change. B. B will tell the others about the time change. Anna will tell the others about the time change. All right. Thank you very much. So. Who will inform the others? Lucy, Sven, or Anna? Who will tell the other people about the change? Who will inform the other people about the change? Lucy, Sven, or Anna? Okay, guys, we are Lisa. going to... Yep. It's a letter C, Anna. I don't know. Depende de lo que diga el audio. We have to listen to the audio first, and then we are going to decide if it's Anna, Lucy, or Sven, right? So we okay, to listen. Yes, yes, we are going to listen uh, right now to an audio, right? So let's see. Look at these questions, all right? We are going to listen to an audio, and you have to 
You have to answer those questions right now. So uh, let me get ready with the audio. Just a second. Okay. Just a moment. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Oh, but I can change it. Uh, 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 uh. All right. Okay. No lo puedo hacer más grande porque no puedo tener las, las dos pantallas, pero déjeme ver. Um, all right. Very good. So you can read it from there. So let's go, people. Let's go. One, two, three. This recording is from the British Council. Hi, Anna. Do you have a minute to talk about the meeting next Tuesday? Sure. We said 11, didn't we? Yeah, we did, but I have a bit of a problem with the time. Would it be possible to move it? Oh, I see. We could postpone it to the afternoon to 1pm, for example, or bring it forward to earlier in the morning. What would suit you? Could we make it 9 o'clock? That would really help me. I have another important meeting in the central office at 12. No problem. It's important you're there. Thanks a lot, Anna. Do you need help with any preparation? Did you get the agenda I sent out? Yes, I did. And no, that's all fine, thanks. My report is ready, and I'm looking forward to presenting it. Great. I can tell Sven about the time change. I'll see him later. Don't worry about telling Sven. I'll send an email to everyone to confirm the time has changed, and with an updated meeting invite. Great. Thanks, Anna. Okay. I'm happy that works for you. We really need you there, and it's good we don't have to cancel it. See you then. Have a good weekend in the meantime. You too. You too. All right. This recording is from the British Council. To All right. How many questions you got? Repeat. How many answers? Repeat, repeat, repeat the, the video. Repeat, please. Sure. Repeat the video, teacher, please. Yes. Yeah. We are going to repeat it one more time. Okay, so let's go. This recording is from the British Council. Hi, Anna. Do you have a minute to talk about the meeting next Tuesday? Sure. We said 11, didn't we? Yeah, we did, but I have a bit of a problem with the time. Would it be possible to move it? Oh, I see. We could postpone it to the afternoon to 1 p.m., for example, or bring it forward to earlier in the morning. What would suit you? Could we make it 9 o'clock? That would really help me. I have another important meeting in the central office at 12. No problem. It's important you're there. Thanks a lot, Anna. Do you need help with any preparation? Did you get the agenda I sent out? Yes, I did. And no, that's all fine, thanks. My report is ready, and I'm looking forward to presenting it. Great. I can tell Sven about the time change. I'll see him later. Don't worry about telling Sven. I'll send an email to everyone to confirm the time has changed, and with an updated meeting invite. Great. Thanks, Anna. Okay. I'm happy that works for you. We really need you there, and it's good we don't have to cancel it. See you then. Have a good weekend in the meantime. You too. All right, you too. So, yeah. how many questions did you answer? One, two, three, four, five, of course. Five. Five, all right. That's wow. all. Who got one? One. One B. Okay. Okay. B. Teacher, wow. One answer. Okay. No. I say I say one P. You say one. Oh no no no. But how many good answers do you have? Like 
three. ¿Cuántas respondieron? One, two, three. I three. 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 Wow. <laughs> All right. Okay. Nothing. All right. Okay. I think All that right. it. Oh. See? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. No. Oh, <laughs> no. It's a, don't tell me nothing. Yeah. All right. So, look at this. We are gonna do something different right now. Okay. <laughs> we are going to listen, and we are going to read. All right. The conversation. Okay. So this time you are going to you are going to read the conversation. This is the conversation. Okay? So please listen and read and then we are going to answer the questions. All right. There we go. One, two, three, go. This recording is from the British Council. Hi, Anna. Do you have a minute to talk about the meeting next Tuesday? Sure. We said 11, didn't we? Yeah, we did, but I have a bit of a problem with the time. Would it be possible to move it? Oh, I see. We could postpone it to the afternoon to 1 p.m., for example, or bring it forward to earlier in the morning. What would suit you? Could we make it 9 o'clock? That would really help me. I have another important meeting in the central office at 12. No problem. It's important you're there. Thanks a lot, Anna. Do you need help with any preparation? Did you get the agenda I sent out? Yes, I did. And no, that's all fine, thanks. My report is ready, and I'm looking forward to presenting it. Great. I can tell Sven about the time change. I'll see him later. Don't worry about telling Sven. I'll send an email to everyone to confirm the time has changed, and with an updated meeting invite. Great. Thanks, Anna. Okay. I'm happy that works for you. We really need you there, and it's good we don't have to cancel it. See you then. Have a good weekend in the meantime. You too. You too. Okay. Let's go. This recording is from the British Council. All right. Let's go here. The meeting time. The meeting time. What is or what was the original time for the meeting. 11 a.m. Eleven a.m. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's continue. Moving the meeting. Lucy wants to cancel, to bring the meeting forward, or to postpone the meeting. Bring the All right. All right. Let's continue. Let's see. The new time. What's the new time? 9 a.m. 9 a.m. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. The agenda. Already sent. Already sent. Already same. This one? Yes. Okay. Do you all agree with the agenda has already been sent out? Number four. Number four. We only have three options. So number one is okay. Anna has already sent the agenda. Yep. Teacher, this is yep. the number four, right? This is, uh, yes, no yes. four. I put letter B, maybe the second. Oh, and I'm sending the agenda, the agenda now. What do you think? What do you think? Let's see, let's see. Already. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My report is great. 
All right. So what is the correct answer? Sending the agenda. Sending? Hmm. We're going to... Dejémosla y vamos a ver. All right. Um, Anna has already sent the agenda. Let's continue. Lucy's preparation. She's nervous. She's looking forward to her presentation. Oh, she isn't ready for her presentation. Looking forward. Looking forward. Looking forward. Looking forward. Looking forward. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Instant. Ready to give her presentation. Ready to give her presentation. Okay. These are are similar answers. Mm. Number letter A and letter and letter C. They are similar, but the correct one maybe is looking forward. Vamos a ver. All right. So let's see. The last one. Who is going to inform the rest of the people about the change? Lucy Anna. Ben, or ben. Anna? Ben. Anna. Ben. Letter C, Anna or Sven? Sven. Anna. Ben. Letter Ben. Oigo algunos convencidos de que es Sven, right? So they are convinced no. that it's going to be Sven. Let's see. Dejemos Sven, right? So let's see. Let's finish the answers. And oh, we have five no. out of six. So let's see. This is incorrect. What is the correct one? Anna. Um, yeah. Anna. Anna is the one who is informed about the about the uh about the the change. Very good. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, just one. Just one incorrect. Very good. Very good. Um, oh, okay. Let's confirm. Okay, let's see. Look at this. Who will inform the others? Look at the paragraph. Um, I will call Sven about the change. Oh, no, no, no. Don't worry about telling him. Oh, my God. I will send an email to everyone. Who? Anna. Anna. Uh-huh. She will inform everyone about the change. So she is in charge of that. So the person in charge is Anna. All right, excellent job. Very good, very good. De poquito a poquito vamos a tener que ir domando este oído, ¿verdad? Que es quizás la parte que más cuesta. El listening es la parte que más cuesta porque no, no tenemos constante oír con el contacto con el inglés. Uh, si yo, yo les, les, les recomendaría una práctica que yo hago, por ejemplo, en las mañanas cuando, o cuando usted tenga tiempo, yo lo hago en las mañanas antes de irme a trabajar. Nomás me levanto, enciendo la televisión y pongo CNN. Es lo primero. Porque es el único, bueno, se pueden otros canales, pero me interesan las noticias y lo pongo en inglés. Y mientras yo estoy haciendo todas mis actividades de la mañana antes de irme al trabajo, Estoy full oyendo CNN en inglés. All the time. All the time. Y ahí usted va a aprender nuevo vocabulario. Va a empezar a entender las noticias. Que es un lenguaje muy bonito, muy gramaticalmente correcto. All right. Y se va a empezar a familiarizar con el idioma. All right. Ahora, si usted, si usted tiene su app en, el, en, el celu, en, el tele, en la televisión, puede poner... Discovery Channel en inglés, uh, National, uh, 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 uh -huh, en inglés, exactly, uh, los canales que se pueden poner en inglés, mientras usted siendo un oficio, no sé, X cosa, haga algo con el oído, all right, para poner, escuche canciones, all right, si es de su gusto escuchar canciones, pero haga okay. algo de poner en contacto con el inglés, ¿por qué?, si no, va a ser bien difícil eh, domar, eh, aprender la, la pronunciación, ¿verdad? Ok, so, let's continue. Instructions. 
to give directions. Let's continue with this. Let's look at this. So we have giving directions. Um, Marvin, Marvin de la Rosa. Marvin, I have a question for you. Yes, tell me. I was looking at your profile picture. Yeah. Do you like do you like skydiving? Yeah, I like skydiving. Really? Yeah. Really? It's um I saw the picture and I was mm, I'm gonna ask him. Yeah. What does it feel? And I'm no saying sé, extremo. Yeah, ah, that's extreme. Yeah. That's extreme. How yeah. much how much money you pay to do that? Or jump is 60 bucks. Oh, no es tan caro. It's not that expensive. Yeah, pero el curso vale 600. Oh, ah, pues no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Excellent. Okay. ¿Harían ustedes skydiving, guys? ¿Paracaidismo? No. 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 No sé en qué, en, qué, en qué situación, pero I wouldn't do it. It's extreme. No, es, es algo que le, le recomiendo hacer. Me imagino que va a ser como bien liberador. I no sé, I don't know. Like, sí. uh, bueno, los primeros saltos. Yo te, apenas tengo cinco saltos, pero el primero sí me dio. Yeah. Bueno, todo, todavía, todavía me da miedo saltar. Pero, really? Yeah, pero no pero, salta solo, ¿verdad? Es con, no, con no, solo. ¿Solo? Solo. Sí, solo. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my god. Right. Where do you do it? Ajá, where? Y lo pongo en el aeropuerto, airport? en el aeropuerto de lo pongo. Uh, oh, all right. Y lo pongo It's airport. expensive. Yeah. Expensive. It's like imagine 600 for the training and then yeah, pero te dan cuatro saltos y el training que Oh, all right. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, you have extreme. a lot of money. I, <laughs> I wouldn't do it. Con que me, da miedo, me da miedo saltarme la grada de aquí de mi casa. Tirarnos <laughs> <laughs> de la coster. De la coster, ya. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. oh, solo, solo subirse a una pasarela, la mía me tiene oh, no Ya. Yeah. Yeah, that, 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 that's extreme. That's extreme. No, me caí en una escalera, así que no quiero yeah. más quebraduras. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Sounds interesting. Very good. Uh, let's see. Let's continue then with this. So, Marvin, we are now giving directions to people, all right? So, we are going to learn the vocabulary to give directions, all right? So, give me a second right here. So please help me, Marvin, reading this part, this one. What are the verbs that we can use? Let's go. Turn, turn left. Okay. Turn right. Uh -huh. Go straight ahead. Go past a cross. Okay, thank you. Very good. So we have basically, we have five. We have more. Yeah, we have like more, but these five, are like the more common ones, all right? So we have turn left, all right? Turn left, or, or another option is make a left, all right? You can say make a left. Turn right, you can say make a right. Make a right, all right? Go straight ahead. It's like a, what's the meaning of go straight ahead? It's like continua recto, right? Wow. Go straight ahead. Uh huh. Go, <clears throat> I'm sorry. Go straight ahead is like dale recto, right? Continua recto, right? Go straight ahead. Now go past. Go past. What is the meaning for go past? Como sobrepasar o pasar. ¿Se da el paso? No. No. O seguir adelante de algo. ¿De qué? De alguna ¿De cosa de la calle. O All sea, right. de la par. De la par. 
de un edificio de un parque de edificio. Excellent, very good. Like in Spanish, we say, pasas el banco y seguís. Así lo mismo, go past. Go past the bank and make a left. Oh, for example. Uh, uh, what was that? Oh, you can say, go past the park and turn left. Oh. All right? So, pasas algo, right? Pasas el banco, o donde está la farmacia? Where is the pharmacy? Pasando el, ba el banco, o go past the bank, and the pharmacy is right there. All right? That is the meaning of go past. So, let's continue. And across. Across is, you know, look at the picture, across. Oh. You, need, you understand across. Now, let's see some prepositions. Jose Cartagena, please. Oh, Melvin, do you have a question? Yes. Sure. Uh, in, in this case, in this case, uh, I, uh, I want to say uh, te pasaste o, o tienes que volver atrás. Okay. Um, in some cases, you cannot like go back. Go back is retroceder, right? So in some cases, you cannot just go back. A menos que vayas caminando, puede retroceder. Pero si vas en un carro, you, <laughs> like, you cannot go back, right? So you need to go back, retroceder, vete para atrás. Or you can return, return, Re right? Retornar. And if you are driving, you can return, mm. all right? And return go back. Other uh -huh. to, 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 again. To, to, return. Return. Yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, we don't have that in English, like uh, you, the you the U-turn, but uh, we don't use that one, right? So you, you can say return, and that's it. Con solo que diga return, igual que en español, date la vuelta, right? So return. And, and uh-huh, right. Uh-huh. That's it. But, okay. But yeah, teacher, but yes, you, you return to pass the bank. Or como pasando yeah. el banco. Como... Yes. Ah, okay. You can say, Carla, mm -hmm. return, return, mm -hmm. and go past the bank. Ah, go, go past. past. Siempre yes. go past. Remember, ah, okay. remember, remember this one, right? Go past. You can okay. return okay. and go past okay. the bank. That's the correct one. Okay. 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 Very good. Okay. So let's continue. Um, Jose, now help us read the prepositions of place. Mm -hmm. So uh, we have four, but we have like 15. But these ones are the most common. Let's go. At the corner of. All right. Next to. Opposite. Opposite. Op opposite. 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 Like between. Uh huh. El acento opposite. aquí. Opposite. opposite. All right. Between. Very good. Thank opposite. you. Uh huh. Between. Excellent. Very good. So we have at the corner of. También es común que digan on. On the corner of o a. Ambas están correctas. So, on the corner of, okay, next to, opposite, or in front of, or across from. All right? And you have between, between the bank and the bookshop. All right? So those are the most common ones. So now we are going to do this one. Okay. Let's see. Aquí estamos todos, right? En esta X. Este es el inicio. All right? So let's see. I need to get to the bookshop. I need to get to the bookshop. 
what are the directions to get to the bookshop? Go straight. Okay, and... go straight. Go straight. How can I say rotunda? Oh, okay. Esperaba que me preguntaran eso. All right. Go straight. Go, go, go uh -huh. straight. Uh, okay, go straight. Okay. Bone Street. Bone Street, excellent. Excellent. Go straight on Bone Street. And, and, and for right. Turn right. Mm. Turn right. Well, the, past of the, the corner. corner. Ahí tendríamos oh, que decir wow. a la esquina de la on ground station. Go street and turn. No, and a left. Go right. No, turn the right of the Cross corner. Right. Under, uh, under the station. Okay, okay. Let's see, let's see. Let's see. Primero tengo que decir pasas el redondel. How do I say that? Number one, go straight. Fast round down. Fast to the road. Okay. Go past the roundabout. Go past the roundabout. Go past the roundabout. In the corner of. In the bookshop is on the corner. On, excellent. And the bookshop is on the corner or of or at at the corner of King's Road, King's Road. and Bond Street. Bond Street. All right, that is the correct answer. Very good. Se lo se puede decir. Uh, the bookstore is at again. No, the bookstore on the corner of Bond Street and King Road. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, use the I have Excuse. a question. I'm sorry. I have a question. Sure. O sea, I, I, dependiendo cuál sea el lado de la entrada del bus, exactly. porque puede estar a un lado de la calle principal o doblando a, a la derecha. Exactly. Como decía Marvin ahí, todo depende de la entrada, ¿verdad? Right? <laughs> de la puerta. No, no, no. no depende de la puerta. <laughs> yeah. That is correct. Very good. Mm -hmm. Now let's continue. <clears throat> okay, <laughs> I am here. I am here. I need to go to. I need to go to the factory. So let's see. Okay, go straight. Uh, make a right. Turn left. Turn left. Turn right. right. On the green street. Go straight. He's next to the main road. Make a right. Turn right. Turn right or make a right. Uh -huh. The factory is around. the museum. And the factory uh, is next to the museum. Past museum. Ah. Okay. Go past the museum. The, museum. the, museum. And the museum. The factory is next to left. On the left. Oh, no, no, no. On, on the right. On the right. On the, on the, on the, on the right. right. Yeah. On the right. right. Excellent. All right. All right. Let's go. I have an emergency and I need to go to the hospital. So what's the correct one for the hospital? Go straight ahead, All right. and round about, no. turn the... To make the left. round about. Left. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Teacher, ¿cómo puedo decir la primera salida? Es que estaba esperando que me dijeran eso, okay? Take the first, the, take the first, y ahí puede ser derecha o izquierda, right? Depending on the uh -huh. address. In this uh -huh. case, okay. is left or right? The first, left. Okay. Left. Okay. Left. okay. So left. Take the left, left, take the first left, all right? So one more time, one more time, let's go. Go straight, go, go all right? Straight. And... Take, take round about round. and take the first. Take the first left. 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 
past police station. Okay. And no, go past. Go past. Go past. Go past. Go past police yes, station. And the next is the it's hospital. The hospital. Aunque saben que estoy viendo. Teacher, is the third, the third left? No, it's the first. Because we have one, two, and That's three. That's true. Three. No, we have one, one and two. One two. and two. Yeah. Take the second no, teacher, left. When no, you turn around. The, 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 the rotonda. Tres salidas. That is Tiene true, cuatro right? calles. So how do you know? Is the in the third the third third left? Mm. The, 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 the first no. no the second the third left. is the third left. The third, the third, the third left. The third left. left. Sí. Yeah. Por eso le preguntaba cómo se dicen primeras y segundas. Así porque por ejemplo cuando yo voy en Waze, Waze me dice de la rotonda toma la tercera salida. Y en All ese right. caso sería King Rocks, donde okay. está oh. el hospital. Ok, entonces, ¿qué tenemos que hacer? Entonces, Cambiar de Entonces, sería take the third. 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 left. And más go straight. You can say, take the, oh, third, okay. take the third left on King's Road. On King's Road. Right? You can take mm -hmm. the third left on King's Road, more specific, and the hospital is next. Next to the police. Pero department. the first Go King's back. Road también is a bus station. The bus station? Mm -hmm. Where is the bus station? No. Oh, I yeah. But this King's is road. number one, number two, yes. number three. three. And you are uh -huh. going to take number three. Uh -huh. Right. So you have to take uh take take what he must take third. Take third. Uh huh. Left. Third left on King's left Road. On King's Road, and the and next the hospital the is police station. next to the police station. Next that to is the correct. police station. All right. All right. Very mm -hmm. good. Very good. Now I need to go to. I need to go. I have some gravings for a coffee. So I need to go to the cafe. I have two options. Two yeah. options. Go to the cafe. Let's go. Number one. Go, go ahead. Straight, straight, right. Go straight. Turn the left. Right. The coffee is mm. in the corner of the King Road. <laughs> All right. In the corner, no. turn the left. Okay. Right. Turn left. Turn left. Uh -huh. yeah. The coffee is the, on the, the corner coffee. of the in coffee or the cafe. The cafe. The cafe is is in the corner of or in front in of the underground. How can I say esquina? All right. In, in front of the underground, the underground station, station or across mm. from the underground station, mm -hmm. right? Or, or in the, in the, on corner. the corner, on the corner, on the corner. of oh, King's Road. King Road. All right. Lo único que cuando decimos on the corner y at the corner, tenemos que mencionar ambas calles, right? For example, mm -hmm. aquí no, tenemos, no sé cómo se llama esta calle. Right, you can say it on aquí, this one. This is a good example. Library. The library is at the corner of Green Street, Green Street and, and Bond, Bond Street. Street. Bond. All right, so I need to mention the cross street, right? So the theater is on the corner of Great King's Road and Bond Street. So I need to mention the cross street. Then the uh, both names, right? That is the only difference, right? Teacher, excuse me. Y si digamos estamos aquí en X y yo puedo decir, vea, voy ahí, estoy ahí en X y digo del primer semáforo a mano izquierda, o sea, como referencia el semáforo. Sure. 
Go Más past, corto para no dar tanta explicación. Go past the traffic light mm -hmm. and take the first, the first left. Right. Mm -hmm. right? Or turn left. Or okay. make a left. All right? Teacher. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Teacher, teacher yeah, para no, calle no. usamos on I y am. para un punto específico usamos at. That's correct. Sí. Mm -hmm. Repitan eso. <laughs> for, for the street, for the street, you say, for example, here, for example, here, you say, Carla, para las calles decimos on. Example, on Kensington Street, on Third Avenue, on Bay Street, on H. Hill Road. So we use on, right? Para las calles okay. no se puede decir otra cosa más que on. On esta calle, on Kensington, on uh, Second Street, Second Avenue, right? Uh, Andrea, do you have a question? Yes, teacher. Sure. Uh, is different corner para esquina o para cuadra? No, it's is the same. same? The same es thing. Lo único que, que cuadra es block. Ah, mm -hmm. block. Block. Sí. Yeah. Block. Eso es cuadra. Right? Okay. okay. So let's see. Voy a elegir a una persona en específico. Okay. So let's go. Al Ting Marín. Ting Marín, the dust, and the, the person that I choose is going to be Pamela Diaz. Let's go, Pamela. I am here. Uh, where am I? Where am I? Let's see. Uh, vamos a poner un puntito. Give me a second. Uh, 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 okay. Me vio que me estaba durmiendo. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Not at all. Oh, ya te, te delataste tú sola. <laughs> all right. Let's go. Here. You are here. In this spot. All right. Here you are. Aquí estás tú. All right. So. You need to go to the post office. Ooh. How <laughs> do you get there? Let's see, Pamela. You can do it. Tú puedes. You can do it. Let's go, Pamela. Yo voy a ir haciendo lo que tú me digas. So I'm here. I'm ready. I know, teacher, me agarró. <laughs> I caught you unaware. All right. I caught you unaware. All right. So let's see. Guess I caught you unaware. Te agarré desprevenida. All right. Caught you unaware. <laughs> All right. So it's okay. It's okay. Let's see. Let's try another one. Don't worry. So uh, please, Pamela, pay attention to this one. It can be very useful for you. So let's see. Let's continue with the uh, next thing. Money. Let's go. And this one is going to be for Wendy Marmol. So I need to go to the post office, Wendy. Give me the directions, please. Okay. Uh, we try ahead. Uh huh. Uh, ahead uh, what? I have two streets here. I have Kensington and I have uh, Second Avenue. Kensington Street. All right. And then I have a traffic. Um, May, uh, right. Okay. Make a right and go past a Tom Thompson Cafe. Okay. Go past Tom Thompson's Cafe. Okay. Come again. Uh, pass the street. Pa pass the street. What do you mean, pass the street? Ah, perdón, perdón, perdón. Yo pensé que estaba la entrada. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. Go past. 
Okay. Provincial bank. Okay. Okay. Uh, to make a right. Uh, make a right. Yeah. Estamos al revés. Uh -huh. <laughs> and to turn left. Okay, turn left. Good. Um, uh, sería next to uh, provincial bank box office. All right. Next to provincial bank. Or oh, another option. Uh, 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 a positive mm -hmm. or yeah. a from. Okay. okay. From. Opposite. Opposite yes. to uh -huh. the police station or in front of the police station or uh, across from the police station. Wendy, excellent. Very good. Let's Thank continue you. with another person, Carla Ashala. Right, Carla, let's see. You are here. Usted está aquí, eh? All right. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. So I need to go to meals by walks. No. <laughs> um, go right um, in Kington Street. Go right. Go, go, go straight forward. Go straight forward. Kensington Street. Yeah, Kensington Street. Should I? Okay, Kensington Street. Okay. And uh, turn left. Okay. Something. Uh, in Second Avenue. Okay. On second on Carla Carla on Second Avenue. On on uh -huh. Second Avenue. Mm -hmm. And eh, antes sería como antes del semáforo de traffic light. Okay. Antes, before, before before the before traffic light or the traffic light. Uh huh. Or you have many places. Okay, hay muchos lugares de referencia. Or uh, in go from past, no go go past to the I know me look aquí Saint um, Thomas Central uh, Center Plus okay Center go past and and turn next to is next to okay era lo que era lo que no miro Center Plus Center Plus Okay, next to Center Plus or in front of Weston's Department Western Store. Weston's Department Store. Teacher, Department Store. Here. All right. <laughs> Good job. Yes. Yeah, okay. but it's okay. Thank you very much, uh, uh, Carla. <laughs> All right. Okay. Now, let's continue with another, the last one, el último. Let's go. This is going to be, vamos a ver, uno de los que tenga la cámara apagada. Vamos a ver. Um, let's see. Lillian. Lillian yes. Ramirez. All yes. right, Lillian. I am here. Look at this. I okay. am here. H Hill Road. All right. Okay. Okay. And I need to go to the park. The park. Yeah. Let's go. Um, go ahead. And Angel H Hill Road. All right. Turn left. No, 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 no. Ah, okay, okay. Turn left and Fed Street. All right. And turn left in Clark's. Okay. Uh, um. Turn left on Second Avenue. Left. No, uh, right. For example. All right. On Second right, Avenue. Avenue. Okay. Go straight ahead. Up. Uh, Kensington Street. Uh huh. 
um so a right left no go go straight ahead oh well, i go straight ahead yes all right it, um from es que no, no veo bien bed the uh, front bed ah the hospital all right it's in front so the park is in front of front? in front of the hospital A hospital okay. hospital or or uh, next to Kensington library 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 or next to or the corner of uh on the corner at the corner, corner of Kensington street and Kensington second on avenue the, on the corner of Kensington, Kensington street, street and, and second avenue excellent very good very good that is directions all right Antes de que se me olvide, let's take the picture. Let's take the picture right now. Give me a second. All righty. All right, all right. Very good. Let me confirm that I have the right picture. Very good. Okay. So let's continue right now. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Let's continue. All right, guys. So no more directions. Let's continue with the next thing that we have for today. And that is going to be present continuous. It's remember that yesterday we studied about it. So let's see. Let me show you this picture. Andrea. Andrea. Yes, teacher. All right, Andrea. What is what is Lucy doing? What is Lucy doing? Lucy dancing? The correct answer. Lucy. Lucy is dancing. dancing perfect excellent remember that the verb to be is mandatory all right so lucy is dancing very good andrea good job let's see let's continue with um rodrigo <clears throat> sam let's see sam here is sam dancing is Sam dancing? No. She, she. Rodrigo? Is he dancing? No, he isn't. No. No. Sam is uh, Sam. Sam is here. Stand up. Look at this. This is Sam. Aquí es Sam, right? So the question is, is Sam, la voy a poner aquí abajo la pregunta, is Sam, is Sam dancing? No. Rodrigo, is Sam dancing? No. He... No. No, la respuesta correcta, no, coma, he, no, he doesn't. He, no, he doesn't. He don't? Isn't. No, he don't? No. no. What is the correct isn't. answer? Isn't. 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 All right. Is, she, is he dancing? No, he isn't. No, he isn't. Okay, so what is Sam doing? Is uh, the compliment dancing? No. It's uh, not important. So, um, the, the, the comp what did you say? The compliment. The compliment and he doesn't dance. He isn't oh, okay. dancing. 
Yeah, you no. can say no, she isn't dancing. Yeah, pero dancing ya no es necesario en una respuesta corta. Solo que lo quitamos. Oh, so, yeah. Sam dancing? No, he isn't. All right. So, Sam is not dancing. So, what is he doing? Sam is drinking. Drinking. What? Drinking. 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 drinking and talking. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. In the sofa. Um, is drinking and talking. Okay. Excellent. Yes. Very good. Brenda. Brenda, Brenda. Uh, what is Tom doing? What is Tom doing? Tom. Tom is uh, singing. Sing, 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 sing. Excellent. Singing. All right. Yeah. Tom is singing. Excellent. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Now let's continue with the next one. This is for Bernice Diaz. Bernice. As it is in the green goes, Bernice. No <laughs> Bernice there. <laughs> All right, Bernie is here. So, Bernie, what um is Jody? Is Jody eating? Is Jody eating? No, she isn't. Okay, she. What is she doing? She is um, dancing. 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 Okay. Dancing. Okay. Excellent. Very good, uh, Bernice. Let's continue with Imelda. Imelda, Imelda, Helen and Eve, are they dancing? No, they aren't. What are they doing then? They are talking. And? And eating. Excellent. Eating. Excellent. Very good. They are eating and they are talking. Good. Jose Roberto Cartagena, Claire and Jason, what are they doing? What are they doing? Is joking, bromeando, no sé cómo. Joking. Joking? Mm, how do you no. say? Tú quieres decir burlándose. Yes, yes. Okay. So how do you say burlándose, people? Okay. Make, in this case, making fun of, burlándose de, for example. Friends. Friends. For example, Jose. Of them. They are. They are making fun of Tom. Perfect. They are making fun of Tom. Right? Very good. Very good. Melvin? Question? Uh, can I say uh, uh, they, they, they is kidding? They is. They is. They, oh, uh, yes. They, oh, they are. All right. They are uh, kidding. Mm, they are kidding. Uh, yes and no. They are kidding is when you are like, ah, están bromeando, right? So they are not, they are not kidding. Ellos no están bromeando con Tom. They are making fun of Tom, right? Uh, uh -huh. So it's the verb, the action is a little bit different. So in this case, they are, they are making fun of him. Or another loving. option. They are, they are laughing. Oh, at, laughing at. Laughing at. Laughing at. Laughing at. So they laughing. are laughing at home, right? So they are oh. laughing at home, right? Okay, very good. Good job, Melvin. So let's continue. Oh, Andrea. Teacher, existe la palabra chambre en inglés. Así como para decir chambrea. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> How can I say <laughs> chambriando? <laughs> All right. Uh, give me one, one, one second. Give me one second. Hay una serie, creo que Maybe talkative. 
Oh, no, talkative no. es hablantín, que alguien okay. que habla mucho. All right. I, I am, I am I very talking. Pero chambre se dice gossip. So, gossip. So, they are gossiping. The gossip girl eran yes. chicas chambrosas. Yes. Oh my uh -huh. God. Gossip. <laughs> so they are gossiping, gossiping about Tom. Or gossiping about I don't know, life in general. All right. Okay. So that is good. Gossiping, chambriar. All right. <laughs> what we say in Spanish. All right. Very good. Let's continue. Wilbur. Bella. What is Bella doing? Bella is the dog. What is Bella doing? Uh, Bella is is drinking ice cream. Okay, drinking drinking an ice cream. Can you drink an ice cream, or maybe mm -hmm. eating ice cream? In this case, it's like eating or drinking a frozen maybe, like an ice cream. Okay, I can take it. Yeah, Bella is drinking something. Good. Now let's continue with Dominga. Dominga, the sí. dog, the dog. Aquí está en español, pero el pato. What is el pato doing? Uh, <laughs> el pato doing. Uh, <laughs> el, el pato go. Is, is go. Is, uh -huh. is go. Is está caminando. Okay, is go. Oh. Is, let's see, the dog. Vamos a poner en inglés. The dog, the dog is is going going yendo or the dog is walking walking walking, walking is better mucho mejor será mejor walking okay the dog okay. is walking okay awesome I, I think running all right I'm sorry I think running okay I think excellent life. running it's another option too yeah that is correct Maida. Let's see, Kering, 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 the cat, the cat. What is El Gato? What is the cat doing? The cat is is pescando sabro. Uh huh. Mm. Fishing. 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 Good. Yes. The cat is fishing. Very good. Very good. Now, let's continue with another person. Let's see. Let's see. Marvin, what is the octopus doing? What is the octopus doing? How do you say silbando? Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, pero ahí no, no, no está silbando. Why? Uh, pitando. Está pitando. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's different. It's different. Pitando. Silbar. Silbar se dice whistle. Okay. Whistle. whistle. Pitar se dice, se dice blowing the whistle. So... What okay, is the, the octopus? Octopus, the octopus is blowing the whistle. Excellent. The octopus is blowing the whistle. All right. Este verbo blow, blow, no solo es explotar, también es soplar. All right. También es soplar. También es, por ejemplo, like this. Give me a second. Okay. ¿Qué pasa si yo digo? The man, the man is blowing a kiss to her. The man is blowing a kiss to her. Le está tirando un beso. Excellent. Very good. Is blowing a kiss. 
tirándole un beso. Jamás en la vida se puede decir is throwing. throwing. Porque throwing es tirar, right? Pero cuando es de tirar un beso, no se dice throwing a kiss. Is blowing a kiss. Blowing a kiss. All right? Good. Lizzie, what is, what is Tom doing? What is Tom doing? Making, uh, sorry, Tom is making, uh, se me fue la palabra de hombre de nieve. Snowman. Snowman, excellent. Okay, <laughs> now Lizzie, give me the complete answer. Okay. Tom is making a snowman. All right. All right. What is the name of the famous oh. snowman? Jack. Hola. Huh? What is the name of the most famous snowman? Olaf. 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 Olaf is the name? Me. No. no, no, it's a laugh. No. Oh, yeah, that's true. Oh, laugh. Yo me acordaba de otro nombre. Yo lo, yo lo había escuchado como Frosty. Ah, Frosty es el payaso. No, it's no, 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 it's the original. All right. Hola. Frozen. Oh, no, no, Frozen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. the original. Excellent. <laughs> Very yeah. good. Very good. Okay, guys. Awesome. Now, let me ask you a question. Do you have any doubts about the, um, the present continuous? We are going to do this exercise, which is very simple. We only have four minutes. No va a tomar menos de eso. Te van a ver. Super fácil. Let's go. Give me a second right now. All right. Let's see. Number one. Mayra. Present continuous. Let's go. Give me a save. Um, he is saving. He? Saving. He? He's he? saving. He, he's saving, saving money because he wants to buy a car. Okay. He's... But, there, but there is one part that is mandatory, Mayra. One part that is mandatory. So what is that part, Mayra? He is. Is. Voy a poner mayúscula. Mire, he is. El verbo to be, Mayra, and everyone is mandatory. So he is saving money. All right? Let's continue with the next person, Diana. You. All right, this is negative. So let's go with this one. Negative. <clears throat> you aren't? Brenda? You aren't? All right. You aren't? Listening. You aren't not listening? Listening, no. listening to me. Okay. You aren't? Not, not listening, listening to me. me. Without not. Okay, why? Because, because I am not. You aren't listening. listening. You aren't listening, listening to, me. to me. All right, very good. Very good. Let's continue with Maria Fernanda. Number three, my parents, my parents, Looking, my parents, um, they looking for a new apartment. My parents, they looking for a new apartment, Maria? Oh, aren't, are looking. 
my parents. <clears throat> my, they... my parents are looking. Okay. My are... parents are are looking. ¿Por qué ya no pongo they? Porque they estoy okay. repitiendo lo mismo que my parents. My parents. All right. So mm -hmm. my parents are looking for a new apartment. All right. So let's do something. The time is over. So les voy a mandar el link. Y ustedes, como yo sé que son gente bien estudiosa y dedicada <laughs> y van a aprovechar su semana, ¿verdad? Lo van a hacer. <laughs> All right. Yeah, on Monday, we are going to review the answers. I have some extra exercises for Monday. All right. Okay, so teacher. give me a second. Let me send the link right now. Teacher. DM. Yes. En la plataforma todavía no trabajamos, ¿verdad? Como no, ya pueden ir avanzando en la unidad 3. Yes. Ya podemos okay. ir avanzando en la unidad 3. All right, guys. 5.30. It's Friday. The body knows it. So we have two days ahead of us. Be good. Se, se, comporta, se comportan bien, por favor. Los estoy mirando, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. yeah. Enjoy too. Always. All right. Si quieren hacer algo extremo, contacten a Marvin, que se van a ir a tirar. Yeah. Y a Pique. All right, people. Enjoy the weekend. See you on Monday. Okay, thank you, Steve. Uh, on Monday. Bye, bye, bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 bye.